Okay, hey Ken. Um, so what you're looking at right now is I did a retopo. Make sure it's on one. Yeah, okay. You see it's so totally void of any detail. Actually, there's a little bit of weirdness right here in this area. But, um, but yeah, like, uh, I was trying to, uh, use, an, um, transfer maps for normal maps and try to uh, get some of the detail from this guy onto this one, um, but it wasn't doing it. And then I actually brought the ZBrush like I did my, um, my DRS asset. And what worked beautifully for that one did not work at all for this one. So I'm wondering what is wrong and stuff like that. Um, I'm wondering since there's probably going to be a displacement in a normal map, I wonder if it matters if it's this generic looking, um, I don't know, it kind of, I don't know, the, it, the look kind of concerns me, um, just how basic, it looks like a base mesh to me, I don't know, but, you know, I'll have to wait to hear from you, um, yeah, I am a little nervous and scared for, um, this final asset, um, because I really wanted it to look as wonderful as possible with textures and hair, you know, everything I wanted to do, which I ended up, I don't know what happened. I think I'm just kind of distracted by other stuff going on in my life, and it's just really hard to kind of focus. And, um, but yeah, I mean, I just, I don't know, I feel like on a dimmer rail, is this really gonna stand out or get me a job? Especially with having a little one on the way, the pressure is on for a job, so I'm just really nervous and scared that all this work isn't going to get me anywhere. Um, I'm wondering if you think I should add anything to the scene, because right now he's just, he's got no shirt or anything. I'm wondering if I should attempt at um, something, something draping over him, or some glasses, something to give him a little personality. Um, because even if I don't get to the texturing, um, yeah, I definitely need hair, and, yeah, so, miracles gotta happen on that one. And, um, I actually did work with some hair, because obviously I didn't just spend four hours on a retopo. Well, eight hours, actually, yesterday and today. Um, I actually did try to do some hair work, which turned out not terrible in fiber mesh. Um, I'm almost going to do tubes, but I thought I could export the curves from the fiber mesh, which I tried to do, but for some reason they won't import into Maya, so it's kind of frustrating. Let's see if I can get it. Okay, uh, okay sorry, I need my flash track. Oh yeah, it is. Okay, never mind. There it is. Okay. Um, Touch up. It could be this one. Let's see if it's this one. It might not work because it's on the newer version, but let's see if it kept anything. No, nope, it crashed. Okay. Alright, well, I can't show you that. Um, but actually, I can show you the hair because um, I accidentally saved it as a Maya file. So there's that. Let's see, I feel like it'd be in the volumes. I always have trouble finding it. Oh well, I'm just gonna do it the other way. The not preferred way. Okay. Here. Let's see if it loads. Looks like it is. And we have some possibly here. Come on. There we go. So you can kind of get an idea of what I was trying to work with. So I was trying to make his mane and uh, this is what I saved out of the brush. I was trying to get the curves from this mesh um, but I think I had it too dense or maybe not dense enough because I had the, um, the setting right above export um, as curves. I brought that all the way down to zero, or it might have been one. So I was just trying to get a few curves. I was trying to get like a million of them. 
And um, yeah, so I was working with that because I figured the hair is really what's going to sell on my Robert Downey. And um, yeah. But anyway, that's my kind of fear and concern right now is what am I going to do? Oh my gosh, I feel like I'm kind of brain farting a little bit. And um, yeah, just a little bit scared. So um, if you have any advice, any quick fixes, any, anything I can do to save this, please share because I really, I really want to have a nice demo reel and I want to show people that I didn't come here for two years to learn nothing because um, I definitely learned a lot and I'm sad I didn't get to do as much as I wanted to, um, mainly because of my own kind of, uh, just my own pitfalls. So, um, anyway, um, hope you have something positive to say. If not, you know, I'll take the criticism and, um, I'll try to work on it. Um, actually at home tonight, probably gonna work real late on the asset and try to get some work on the hair. Maybe clean up the mesh a little bit. Um, I noticed there were a lot of, well not a lot, there was a few things I thought was kind of taking away from what him looked like Robert Downey. I don't know. Like, I still look at this mesh and I still see so many errors and it's just driving me crazy because, you know, I wanted it to look as good as possible and maybe being a perfectionist is a bad thing with this, but, um, but yeah. But anyway, um, well, at least we're not getting, um, peer-reviewed this month because I think I would be sweating bullets. And, um, but yeah, anyway, uh, sorry this is kind of long, uh, Hopefully um, you're okay with how things are going. The topology might need work. Probably definitely needs work. Well, you know, I exit out of the screen. But, um, but yeah. Um, yeah, uh, if you could give me anything else, that'd be great. Alright, thanks, Ken. I'll talk to you in class.